What is water quality? Let's see if someone can determine water quality by looks alone. So I'm here with Nikki, and Nikki's going to show us which one she thinks has the best water quality. Of these six examples, which do you think has the best water quality? When it comes to determining water quality, there's more than meets the eye. Water clarity may not necessarily mean water quality. The most widely used definition of water quality is the chemical, physical, and biological characteristics of water, usually in respect to its suitability for a designated use. As we all know, water has many uses, including drinking, carrying and treating waste, swimming, livestock, cooking, industry, irrigation, boating, fishing, washing, transportation, hydroelectric power generation. Each of these uses have different defined chemical, physical, and biological standards necessary to support that use. For example, we expect higher standards for water that we drink and swim in compared to water that is used to carry and treat our waste or for some industrial uses. Water quality standards are put into place to protect the various designated uses of a water body, such as fishable, swimmable, etc. Water bodies are then monitored by states to ensure that these standards are met and that a water body supports its designated uses. So which sample had the best water quality? Yes, it's definitely number three. It depends on our intended use. The best water quality for drinking water is sample number two. The drinking water with yellow food coloring is the only sample that is safe to drink without further treatment. But what is the best water quality for irrigation? Sample number five would be the best because it also has nutrients that the plant needs to grow. In conclusion, the importance of good water quality that supports designated uses will continue to increase in the future. Visit www.uaex.edu and check out the publication, What is Water Quality? to learn more. For more information on protecting water quality, contact your local county extension office or watershed partnership. This podcast was funded by the Arkansas Natural Resource Commission and Environmental Protection Agency.